4D animations are becoming increasingly more popular and useful. A 4D animation is a tool that is meant to present the building construction through time and a great way to present the project's schedule or sequence. This is all going to be part of a four-part tutorial series demonstrating four different unique ways to achieve this effect using Lumion. I have here a Revit model that's fully detailed that I was going to show as an example. But keep in mind this can be done in any 3D software. So we're going to go ahead and get started with Lumion opening up a blank scene. And this first video is going to focus on the simplest effect, which is just using the, an animated clip plane. Now I'm going to bring in this Revit model we saw before. And using the clip plane I'm going to slowly reveal this building. Now this is a really detailed building and it works really well when we have everything modeled, but keep in mind that this effect can also be used on a less detailed or hollow model. Now I'm going to go ahead and import some materials and settings that are already set up for our building here. And just to reiterate, this, this model actually has all structural and MEP models in it. So when we add our clip plane, it's going to be able to reveal all of those details. So let's get started by finding the clip plane. It's located under the light tab and the last tab here are the utilities and there it is. So we bring it into the model and we see all of this grid showing where the clip plane is located. And we could push and pull this up and down to reveal how exactly this works. Now I've quickly added some trees to show that the clip plane tool cuts through everything except for Lumion's trees and vegetation and also the terrain. So that's the first thing to keep in mind with the clip plane tool. Also note that it'll cut our model but it'll not fill it. So be careful on what you show. And another great thing to keep in mind is that we can rotate this clip plane in many different ways. We may not only want to show an up or down cut, maybe we'll do a left or right and we could even experiment with bank and pitch rotations and get whatever effect we want to see. Uh, every project's different. Now let's go ahead and set up a scene so we can put this effect into practice. So let's go ahead and just start with any simple scene. You could just use one camera shot and give us a decent amount of time. We're going to be using the advanced move tool here. It's found under objects and there it is advanced move and if any of you haven't used the advanced move tool here just go ahead and hit the pencil and you see in front of us we have our time scale now we need to make sure that this is the duration there on the left is longer than our total duration or we get some issues so we have full control over the timeline here it shows our seconds and we're going to grab our clip plane and we're going to tell at the very beginning to start at the bottom and it shows that little keyframe it's created. Now we bring it up towards the top, give us a little space to admire a building when it's complete, and we can do a, a test view right here and watch it go up. And that's exactly the effect. Let's watch it in this view. And there you have it, a very basic but effective visualization method showing our building going up. And here's our final rendering. Obviously I've added some plants, some more entourage to it as well, and I have some more camera movement but just go ahead and take a look and see how effective and beautiful this can be especially when we have all this detail embedded into the model now as you can see this is very easy any of you guys can all do this and I expect you to play around with this and create a more innovative way to show off your building and design and blow away your clients well thank you for watching this tutorial Remember, this is only part one on the 4D animations with Lumion. Next, we'll be utilizing the SkyDrop tool. Make sure you check it out.